Can you use the Fender Mustang Micro Live? That's what we're about to find out. Welcome back to the channel. My name is Jimmy Franklin. I did a review of the Fender Mustang Micro, like, uh, geez, maybe it was two years ago now at this point. I don't know. Maybe it was a year ago. When I first received it, I thought that I was not gonna like it that much. I didn't know what to really think about what it was. Then, let me tell you, in a real life scenario, when you're a new dad and you have a sleeping baby and you have things that you need to practice, this little headphone amp was unbelievably handy. It stays in my bag all the time with me just in case. I realized recently that maybe you could use it in a live setting and the fact that it has an awesome battery life may make it super useful. Now, before we get into this, I just wanna say I do not think that this is going to be the greatest live rig of all time. That's just not what this video is. But if you are in a scenario where you're like on the go, busking, maybe playing you know, in the subways, or you just wanna like film some cool stuff outside or play outside and you're on the go and you need to run everything on battery life, this may be a great option. Or maybe you're doing like a small, small bar gig and you just need something to quickly plug in. I am hoping that maybe this would be something that could be useful in that scenario. Always remember that all of the links to the products in my videos are below and it's no extra cost to you and it does help support the channel. So thank you so much. Now, behind me, I have from one of my recent videos, the Mackie Thump Go, which has proven on multiple occasions to be an unbelievably useful product as well. And it also runs on battery life. So the way I look at it, it's this is everything here just needs to be charged up and you could just be on the go. You could play wherever you like. In this case, what I have here is a cable that on one end is your typical quarter inch jack and then the other end is like a headphone eighth inch jack. And this is gonna be the thing that really helps us in this situation. So we're all rigged up. Go right into channel one of the Mackie Thump Go and plug right into the headphone jack of the Mustang Micro. It's as easy as that. I wonder if I could do another video where I make this wireless. Maybe that's coming down. This may be kind of annoying in the sense that it's gonna like flop around and stuff. Ooh, okay, maybe not. Maybe it's not a big deal. I don't know. Stay there, okay. Okay, so far so good, let's see. Not bad yet? Really? Okay, I'm at a complete and utter loss for words right now. Here's what I'm thinking. If I was in a scenario where I wanted to just go out and busk in the subways of New York, if I wanted to play out on the street somewhere, on a street corner, I could easily, in a, in a backpack, rig up the Mackie Thump Go. All I'd have to do is like Bluetooth my iPhone to it and then I could also plug this in and I could easily do covers on, like I could just pull up a song on YouTube and play for the people, oh my God. So what's happening here is this is a very small, teeny, teeny, tiny version of basically a modeling setup, right? Let's say you had like an Axe FX or a Line 6 Helix and you were plugging it into an FRFR speaker, that's basically the same idea as this. In this case, I have the Thump Go set up to its music mode, and I've done no other EQ besides just some volume. That's it. And the awesome thing is if you need to take a solo, your volume is just right here. You could just reach over and turn the volume up or down however you need.
Wow! Ooh. Oh. What? Yeah. Oh. Let's get this little stratty sound going. Wow, absolutely wonderful. Ab for, for, okay, now I keep saying how amazing this is. I wanna just be clear that I'm not blown away by like, these are the greatest tones in the world. This is not, uh, I'm not sitting here saying that this is as good as like, you know, an original Vox AC30 or like, I'm not saying that this is better than your Marshalls and all your other stuff or your Axe Effects. But for the scenario, this is unreal. Like it's never been easier for someone to just go out and express themselves. And that's what I think this rig is totally useful for. Now I just gotta figure out how to make it wireless in another video. Let's try something other. Little warm, little bit jazzy, right? One super problem with this is that you would have to learn, like, uh, let me see this, see? The thing is that the Mustang Micro has this little color system and you have to just either keep the card that it comes with or you have to just memorize all the colors. I still have not figured it out. I just know when I hear something distorted with great delay sounds, I love it. So let's see, let's see, one more. Doubt you're going to play Ramstein songs on the side of the road, but I don't know. You do you, I guess, right? So all I'm saying is that you could easily get away with this if you need to. There's never been a better time to be alive. And if you want to know more about either of these products, the Mustang Micro or the Mackie Thump Go, go watch one of these videos right here.